Hello everyone, this is MC Rich S. Welcome back to Ghost of the Doll 78. The reason that I'm speaking like I'm a little bit defeated is because I am. I filmed, or thought I'd filmed, a video unboxing Claude Wolf. Did the whole thing. Struggled with the packaging, was talking about the differences between G1 and G3. It was like a half hour video. And I forgot to press record. So, what I'm going to do... <laughs> I am one silly girl. So... I am actually recording now, so what I'm going to do is we're going to set him off to the side. What are you eating? Hang on a second. MC Canadian Dollars just picked something up one moment. What have you got in your mouth? Okay, nothing. She was just chewing. I don't know what she was chewing because she swallowed it. So yesterday I went to TK Maxx and I got the Barbie fashion designer from, I want to say last year, for $12.99, which is a really good price. I did want... I did want her, but she was, I, I wasn't paying that much money for her. So I've already cut the tabs on the box. As you can see, I'm just going to, let's pull the camera out a little bit. So we've, is that, is that better? Yes, I think it is. So I'm going to try and stay here. So the volume of my voice doesn't dissipate and then come back and go again. So we'll start off. Pink box. All cardboard. Now in my unrecorded... <laughs> in my unrecorded video for Claude Wolf. I was complaining about the fact that there's so much plastic packaging and and this is this is all cardboard which is really cool okay so in the box we have a tailor's dummy purple barbie chair Hang on, I'm just going to tilt down a little bit. There we go. We have... Sewing table. And a little sewing machine. We have... Three sets of clothes with hangers, shoes and accessories. And we have fashion designer Barbie. I'm going to start with the accessories and let's just, there we go. I just need a bit more. I really should have done this before I started recording, but she's a messy girl. You know this about me, or rather, you will if you don't already. So there is the little sewing setup. Let's start with the outfits. No, let's start with the doll. So as you can see she's in a bag 
in the bag with her is so we have Barbie with the bun I really detest this hairstyle I, <laughs> I really don't like it I I I just think it's a lazy hairstyle. Um, you know, if I'd have paid forty five quid for this doll, I would have been upset that she came with a bun. So in the bag with her comes. A little tape measure which she can wear around her neck I'm just gonna move these out of the way so we can have a look at the outfits oh actually no first let's see if we can fit there's a little potted plant that should go there when we find it Do you know what? Let's pop that to the back. We can uh, we can deal with the little potted plant when I find it. Stay there, madam. Okay, so here's the three outfits. They're all sealed off from each other. I'm going to start with this one first. So in this one we have, oh yeah you can go in there as well. We have hangers, a bag, Two hangers, a little pair of ballet flats, a green handbag, some gold sandals. This Barbie has flat feet, so you know. Oh, yeah, we've got. Scissors. A top that has, that's a really weird neckline. We're gonna to have to try it on it, aren't we? And a scrap of dog tooth check fabric to sew with. So we'll put these aside for now. And let's have a look at outfit number two, or package number two. I hate these bags, stupid, stupid plastic. Okay, just get everything out. Yay, I found the pot plant. So, <laughs> it's a little pot plant up. So that guy was, deal with this now. That goes there, look. In this section, we have floral fabric to sew with. I'm gonna put all the fabric in the box. We have some kind of collot type trousers, clam diggers, I'm not sure what they are. Some flat black boots. 
Red handbag. I think that is a bobbin of cotton which goes up here. Or does it go on there? Yes. Have a pin cushion that we clip on there like that. Have a little necklace accessory. I'm gonna put that that in there. We have Sonny's. They're pretty cool actually, yeah, quite like those. You can go back there. Okay, and the last bag. Again, I hate this plastic. It's it's a and you know I go to the gym, I lift weights and I struggle with this plastic. So let's have a look. We have some geometric fabric for sewing. We have a Spotty dress, that's, yeah, that's cute. We'll try everything on it in a minute. We've got another bobbin. This we'll clip on there. We have another necklace, got another handbag. Oh, they're cool. Heart heart shaped glasses. And we've got some pink platformy sand, strappy sandals. And this, which I want to say is her little design sketches for what she's going to make. So, so Barbie has five points of articulation until I'm going to do something with that hairstyle not now but I, I will do something because it's so offensive so well I'm just I'm gonna undress her off camera because I don't know if it's this, if it's the same with YouTube, but Facebook has an issue with dolls that have no clothes on. So just to be uh, just to be on the safe side. We're gonna dress her off off camera. I think I have In fact, I know I have in my unboxing video of the stuff that I got from my friend Jamie, a lot of those dolls were new. So, okay. So, here she is. Yeah, they, they kind of like collapse. So let's pop the shoes on, the boots on. So yeah, that's a that's a choice. I, I, if I were if I were Barbie, I honestly don't think I'd wear that. So next, we're going to try on the dress. Which I think we're going to have more success with. Oh no, that is, oh cute, yeah, 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 I like this. Just I'll just wait until I show you. So it's an Empire Line 
little sundress. Well, perhaps not empire line because empire line would be right under the bust, but you get the idea. We'll try with the flaps on first. Now, I, I love a gladiator sandal. I, I have a pair of gladiators myself, but they have pretty much the same soles as these ones. Not plastic, but very thin and there's no grip on them. I keep meaning to take them to get them uh, resold, but... So here she is in the little gold gladiators. And now for the pink platform strappy sandals, which I'm going to use. The uh, the gold the gold coloured necklace. So yeah, I I think I am going to keep her in this outfit. I like this outfit. So just going back to the uh, the sewing machine, the little bits there. Okay. So I am an absolute sucker for a decent place I, I love a place Oops. I just need to do this off camera because I can't oh come on oh, okay maybe not that one so We're going to pop the... So the scissors go on there. Little scissors. I'm going to pop the little inspiration board there. I played the bar. Oh, there you go. And there's a little little foot pedal there for the sewing machine forgot about that so let's see how this barbie fares sat at the sewing machine with the legs straight sticking straight out in front of her okay that's okay okay i think i can live with that and of course she's got the manic in there. I'll just turn it to the side so we can get a better idea. So yeah, that is that is a really cool little playset. Emphasis on little because I do not have a lot of room in my doll room or on my shelves in my lounge. I have the Charlie video almost finished, so that will be going up at the weekend, but I just wanted to do a quick unboxing video just so you have something to tidy over until I'm back with the Charlie video. Thank you very much for watching. Please make sure you like, comment, share and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.